Let's see this heading which says Cartesian equation of a knife. So after vector equation, this time we have Cartesian equation. Cartesian equation of any line which is passing through the point x1, y1, z1 and direction ratios being proportional to the a's, b and c is what? That is given by a formula which is x minus x1 upon a is equal to y minus y1 upon b is equal to z minus z1 upon c. That means this is the prescribed or set formula to find the Cartesian equation of a line. Now remember one thing, if you have been given vector equation in a question, you can always convert into Cartesian equation and vice versa is also possible. Now it depends upon you that how you want to go about that question. If a question is given in vector form and then an answer is asked to it, better solve it in the vector form only. But if a question is given in uh, Cartesian form, it is better to follow this methodology. Still, nobody can question your answers um, accuracy or something. If your answer is correct, you can leave your answer in any form else the question asks. What I mean to say is, suppose the question asked in the last to find the vector equation of a line. Even if you are doing with the Cartesian method, at last you have to convert it into vector equation in order to leave the answer as asked by the examiner. 